Welcome to our lecture online. There are two kinds of histograms. The first one is the one that gives you the frequency of each class. Now, what is a histogram? Well, it's essentially a bar graph, but with a specific specification about the bar graph. A histogram is a type of bar graph that represents the entire set of data. In other words, you cannot omit any classes. So any class containing data must be represented by the histogram, which means that all the data here represents 100% of all the data that you have obtained. Now this particular one gives you the frequency of each class. Notice at the bottom we've given the boundaries of each class and of course it represents the grades that were obtained particularly in a specific class on a specific test. And notice you can see that in the first class from, and I should of course put the boundary here, that would be 29.5 to 39.5, the frequency is 1. The next class is 1, the next class is 1, a frequency of 3, 8, 6, and 5. And so that represents all the data. There's a total of 25 pieces of data. They're all contained within the histogram and it represents 100% of all the data. So this is how we, what we call, group them together into a histogram which gives you the frequency of each class, the frequency of occurrence of the data of each class. And that is what we mean by a histogram giving you the frequency.